Okay, I'm going to demonstrate uh, editing the Lilo config file. We'll get uh, a super user terminal here. Um, Now, there's a couple reasons we edit this file. The main one would be to shorten the timeout. By default, this is the way the file looks, and of course, all the comments are in blue in the VIM editor. Now, we could, if this is a single boot system, we could just comment this out. Just put a, um, not that, a um, pound sign at the front of the line and it wouldn't prompt you at all it would just go ahead and boot the uh, the uh, first or the default um, image which would be this but now if it's a dual boot you're going to see two different you know you have Linux and Windows you're going to see two different options to boot at the Lilo prompt when it first comes up you'll have Linux and Windows so in this case we're going to want to um, leave a timeout, but just shorten it because we feel like that we don't really need 120 milliseconds, which would be like a minute and a half. So basically, all we would do is change that to say 20 out of convenience. I just hit the X over those and we change it to 20 milliseconds. You see? That way, you're only going to wait for two seconds and then you've got the option to um, boot either of your two images okay and then hit the escape key a timer two you're back to uh, uh, command mode and you can do colon wq to write the file and then when you're done you have to use the command lilo to actually write the um, to write your um, bootloader back to the master boot record and make the changes in other words um, so anyway you've you've got um, a shorter timeout now it'll only be two seconds instead of a minute and a half so anyway that's a pretty easy thing to do to shorten your your boot times and remember, you can, if it's a single boot system, you can just comment the prompt um, out, and you won't have that. Of course, I always comment the prompt and the timeout lines if I do that. So anyway, that's, that's all there is to it. It's a pretty easy way to shorten your boot. Thanks for watching. Hope this helps.